Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be completing off some of Norio's missions. So we basically sort of put off saving Kushi Temple up until now uh, because of Norio. I didn't have the time to do the Norio missions yet and we've completed the first three. So we're going to be heading out and doing the rest of the last four and hopefully we can finish them all in one video. So without further ado, I'll be traveling to Kushi Temple and I'll come back to you guys when I'm there. This is the second temple, I think, that you can find uh, in the Toyotama region. The first one obviously being the um, Omi temple. But now that we're at the village, I mean this... Fighting at Kushidera temple. Monks are in danger. Yep, monks are in danger. But it doesn't say the Kushi temple has been taken over by Mongols, so I think we should be fine. We should, we should just be helping Norio, I believe. Norio! What's up? Nice easy slash right there. Come on, come at me. Good block. Come on with me with more lances. Come on. Nice. Perfect parry. That's what we strive for in this game. <laughs> nice. Another perfect parry. Nice. So just quick push off, and I think we're good. Let's talk to Norio. My lord, look what they've done! Kushidera Temple deserves reverence, not bloodshed. Centuries of wisdom lie within those walls, and the Mongols were ready to torch it all to the ground. They attacked for a reason. The temple gives people hope. The abbot's been telling people to pray for a great storm to wash the invaders from our home. Now the abbot's missing, and the brutes stole the most sacred relic in Toyotama, a statue of Buddha carved at the temple's founding. My brother would have recovered then. He would have given these monks hope before they ran for the hills. Then we honor his memory and restore the temple. The Mongols stole the statue of Buddha from the main hall. And the abbot? He and his closest followers fled. I'm hoping they found shelter. I guess that makes sense. Most of the monks aren't warrior monks. So it makes sense in this context. Also, there's a headband on top of that pagoda. I'm going to grab that before we start this mission. So give me a sec. All right, guys. So we just got the headband at the top of this pagoda. We got a plum blossom headband. So we're going to drop down real quick. And uh, let's go talk to Norio. So the first one here, I believe, is this one. The one that's right in front of me. But we're just going to quickly check the journal. Number five, the Blood Sutra. And let's see if it's this one. Yep. Hope Abakome is safe. Let's talk to him. The abbot is from Cedar Temple. Why did he come here? To help resist the Mongols in Toyotama. But when they attacked, he escaped. The battle was chaotic. Might be difficult to track them. There's a farm nearby that supports the temple. We'll start there. Alright, so even though the fourth mission was really short, I guess it was because of the fight, but I guess that should give us enough time to do five, six, you know, the rest of the missions. There are a lot of missions. Alright, reach Yoshimitsu Farm with Norio, about 600 meters away. So let's just keep on riding. The mine, yeah, the abbot must have found Listen shelter. To it. This and reminds me of another time reach. Abbot Kome went missing. The temple was divided. Wow, that was a lot of overlapping voices. Senior monks. What were they that, was, that was confusing. I don't remember, but it seemed important at the time. The abbot disappeared for a week. We dropped everything to look for him. What happened to him? He hid from us on purpose, and we stopped fighting in order to find him. Huh. That's a cunning lesson that would make things worse. I don't know. A cunning lesson? He's a cunning leader. Another time, my brother and the healer, Hochi, were fighting. The abbot started carrying the rock everywhere, arguing with it night and day. Hochi and Enjo were so embarrassed that they reconciled. How did your brother feel about the abbot? Enjo respected him like a father. If the Mongols capture the abbot, it could work out well for us. It sounds like he'd tricked them into giving up the invasion. <laughs> You're beginning to understand Abbot Kome. Uh, is it here? Okay, yeah, it's definitely this farm. I've I've freed this farm previously. Um, yeah, this isn't the right way to go because this is just a sheer cliff. So that's that's not gonna work out. We're gonna have to go back a little bit. 
But yeah, this is pretty cool. I guess all the stuff with um, with the Abbot here is pretty interesting. Not exactly what you expect. But I am confused about the sort of direction uh, these missions are going to take. Because I guess Norio is one of those characters that initially seemed like they were rationally introduced, but actually played a large part because of their warrior monk status. Just kind of curious to see exactly how these missions will go. Because we already are on mission 5 after all. Alright, here we go. Coming from the farm. Fire, wait, hold up, I can't see fire. Where's the fire? I'm blind. I just freed this farm like, like, quite shortly before. Why is there fire again? I can't see it. Hold up, actually let me, let me get off, because I can't see anything. Where's there fire? Uh, I don't, oh, that fire, okay, okay. Wait, that's the leader house that I was... That I freed before when I was doing the Masako missions. Hold up. What happened here? Let's talk to some people. Search the house for signs of the abbot. Is that the abbot or the monk? They were cut down escaping the fire. The abbot's not with them. Check inside. There's so many overlapping voices because there's people talking. Burned alive. No, you. We should help rebuild. When you can hear the people just talking in the background. It's an absolute mix. Is it the abbot? The bastards love their fire, don't they? He's not the abbot. Just one of his followers. Keep searching. Okay. It does seem kind of oh, sad, though. Someone being burned tough. alive. Straw bedding. Hmm. Damn. Could the abbot have saved himself? Completely possible. He protected himself with wet bedding. Escaped out the back. Maybe he survived. Wow. Abbot pretty smart though. No, it's cracks. Then there's still hope. Do we follow oh. I thought we were gonna follow the straw, but no, there there are footprints. Right. I mean I guess they just followed this road. Farther apart. He was running. Running seems a lot more appropriate than Walking with him the oh, oh. What's he doing? Stay quiet. I can easily assassinate one guy. I think they're tracking the abbot as well. Definitely tracking the abbot, right? Let's hit up the uh, focus here. Oh, focus hearing. Wow, there's like a couple of mongols. Okay, switch back to normal arrows. There are a couple of people. Can I do a standoff though? The real question I have. Let's see if I can take them out stealthily. Nice. Let's two down. Let's switch it to fire for the uh, leader. Oh dang! I can't hit the helmet. <laughs> I used up all my arrows, but we killed everyone. Oh, that's a dead person. Hold on, let me just uh, quickly grab the supplies. Ow. Right, investigate the area. So, I guess we're not looking at this person, so... Oh, there's blood here. More blood. He jumped Wait. down. Off the into the waterfall? Wait, can I do that? Hold up. Big brain moment. What if I jump? Okay, I don't die. Okay. I initially thought we'll still get fall damage, but okay. Let's check here. Oh no, he died. That's not good. No. Is he? I'm sorry, Norio. I think he bled out. Without his leadership, the monks will leave. And the temple will fall. The Mongols won. What's that next to him? A Lotus Sutra. Written in the abbot's blood. His final act. Like a samurai's death poem. 
The point of this sutra is that we can all be Buddhas. From the lowest peasant to the greatest noble. Written with his dying breath. Not for himself, but for those he left behind. Show the sutra to the monks. If they see the abbot's devotion, they might stay. I do hope so, they'll stay. And this is the sutra the abbot wrote in his own blood. A final act of devotion. A call to stand up to cruelty. A call to stay and not surrender. We will honor the abbot's sacrifice, Norio. We must not let Kushi Temple fall. Enjo the Guardian saved us once. Now his brother and Lord Sakai have saved us again. And together we can defeat the Mongols. Nice! So we complete off the fifth mission, the Blood Sutra, which I guess now makes sense. And all the monks have stayed, which is great. So which means we can now start on the sixth mission and see what's up with Norio. We don't know about like a seventh or eighth mission yet because there's only, you know, five and six is currently available on the map. So I guess there's only so much we can do. Or hold up. Oh, we need to fuck. Oh, no. Still, still this one. The still the next one. Right, let's talk to the person inside. Let's get the sixth mission on the road. Where would they take it? Hi there. The statue is here. Yes, my lord. The Mongols stole our sacred Buddha and rode off toward the coast. We'll return the statue and save this temple. Not even your brother could keep that promise, Norio. Okay. So I guess we're starting off the sixth mission to find the statue. What was that about? My brother fell to a Mongol blade. Enjo the Guardian dies, and these monks are willing to give up everything. They're cowards. They're people. Enjo feared nothing. He wasn't even 20 when he saved this temple from bandits. Now it's up to us. Alright, here we go. The Cause of Suffering. Which is the sixth mission. Is it? I need to check. I kind of forgot. It wasn't nine missions for Norio. Give me a second. Yeah, it's nine. It's nine tales for Norio, so it's, to it's going to be a bit lengthy. The, the monks said they took it toward the coast. We can pick up their trail. Although I wonder if it's all six tales in Act Two. I feel like it's more appropriate that they'll do nine acts across. Oh, no, sorry, not nine acts. Nine missions across two acts. So I feel like it's a lot more likely we're gonna get oh, angry. How can you tell? three more in the next act. Ha! It's that he doesn't know the whole story about my brother saving Kushidera. I heard Enjo acted alone. That's the legend. In reality, he ordered three of his bravest monks to challenge the bandits. A distraction. A sacrifice. They died in battle, but only after giving Enjo enough time to flank the bandits and save the temple. Oh, um, th that makes it sound less epic, but, you know, at the, at the end of the day... Oh, are you, are you good? What happened? I was following the Mongols. I begged them to give back our Buddha. Where did they go? Out of the forest. To the hills. May your next life be more peaceful than this one. Oof, poor monk. I mean, he did he do gave good. His life for his temple, like my brother. You will do the same. All right. Now let us head over to the hill. Uh, like the guy said, said uh, at the forest to the hills. So let's check the wind, which is not really blowing anywhere. So I assume those are the hills. Look at this barricade. That's a mobile camp up front. I have no more arrows. Hold up. Nice. Now let's move in. Maybe do a quick standoff. The statue must be there. First, we punish them for attacking the temple. Can we do a standoff? Yep. Let's do it. Gotta flex that Sakai armor and do it like a like a quintuple kill if I can. Oh, 
What? I thought I timed that right. Pain. <laughs> Nice. Alright. Oh gosh, this guy's gonna shoot a gun at me. Ow, what? I thought I got out the blast range. Man. Alright, another guy down. Nice. Where is the assassin guy with the flashbang? Ow, that hurts. Okay, did I take care of this guy? Ow. The flashbangs are a pain. Ah, oh, I can't see anything. Right, should be able to collect some supplies though. We do have a couple of Buddha statues out front, so who knows? I do need to pick up arrows though, so let me let me find somewhere to get some arrows, or maybe we just stick to heavies. Nice. I think that should take Look care of the him. statue. Yep. Find the statue of Buddha. Right. There's a good opportunity to also get some ammo and maybe some artifacts, you know? I don't know if there's any artifacts in this camp, though. Where would the statue be? Oh, we're supposed to do this. Drag this way. Over by the water. Oh, we're supposed to be doing this. Wait, what? Over by the water? this oh this among the artifact hey that's a shield taking that there it is carved from a star that fell what from the, the heck heavens centuries ago that that's the statue anything else like it on the island let's get it back to the temple oh god I'm so confused <laughs> angel became the guardian when bandits attacked the temple they came for this statue. It's priceless. Probably survived many such attempts. How many more people have to die protecting it? You want to let it be stolen? <laughs> no. But the temple is filled with treasures. It provokes greed and envy. Lord Shimura brought me to see it when I was a boy. I was sure the sculptor must have met the Buddha in person. When I was a boy, my family traveled here to make an offering for the new year. That's when Enjo and I decided to become monks. I used to know what I fought for. We fight for... Alright, so I think... I think they initially assumed that we would go to the camp through another way, but we somehow routed around back. So the statue that I thought was just randomly there was in fact the statue we were looking for, which is kind of weird. But anyways, we did finish off the sixth mission, and now we have the seventh one that's readily available to us. Right, I think we're going to do the seventh mission as well. Let's talk to Norio. I don't know if that means like the 8th and ninth mission will come accordingly, or it was still the entirety of the idea of Axe, you know? Hi, Norio, can I speak My to Lord. you, please? Norio, have you spoken with the monks? Their resolve is growing, but they still fear the Mongols, as they should. Where is everyone? At the river, bathing, washing clothes. Who's that coming to the temple? Look, a Mongol eye. Oh. He's alone. See what, what if it's an Enjo situation and it's a flank? The ghost and the brother of the guardian. I have a message for you. Speak. The ghost and the monks have defied the Khan's will. Surrender, and we spare this place. Refuse, and all will burn. We will never surrender. Then you will die. Oh gosh. Well, I guess we're gonna have a nice fight, aren't we, huh? Psych messenger. We've defied the Khan too many times for you to do anything. They don't have time to reach shelter. Then we'll be their shelter. I can't. The Buddha. 
The Abbot Sutra. Are they worth more than the monks' lives? I can't save them alone. Centuries of learning reside in this temple. I can't let it burn. But you'll let the monks burn. I will die for this temple. Do what you have to. Okay, Norio. I mean, I don't mind, really. But then I guess we're going to have to go save some people. I'll find the monks at the river and bring them back. One shall protect the temple. One shall protect the people. The end of suffering. I don't know if this means the end of suffering for the temple. Uh, hopefully it doesn't mean the monks will die. Hopefully that means more Mongols will die. But the title is kind of ominous. But let's head over to the river. We got, a, we got some monks to save and I have no arrows. So we're going to be relying solely on the power of our blade. Which is going to be intense if you ask me. Mongols coming! Get away from the river! Wait, where? Where are the Mongols? Where are the Mongols? Oh, there they are. Wait. Do I have my sticky bombs? Oh, yeah. Lol. Goodbye. Nope. Nice. That broke through. Nice. Okay, Norio has come to aid us after all. Wait, where are the rest of the Mongols? I'm just here collecting supplies. Oh, here they are. Nice. More kicks. Nice armor break. Break through. Nice. Broken through. Much. Nice. No, no, no. No running away. No, no. You chose this. Right, then we probably need to go back to the temple or something. But let's talk to Norio first. Norio, what are you doing? The temple's undefended. Temples can be rebuilt. Lives can't. We'll defend the monks at the pagoda. Lead the way. All of you, All right, come with so us. Our final, our final holding. We're going to hold the temple against the Mongols at the pagoda. That's actually pretty cool. I was about to say this monk was like naked, but no, no, no. That, no. He's got his loincloth on. I think we're good. I really hope we can defend it. But I think, I guess it really depends on the story. If the story dictated that the temple will fall, it'll fall. But depending on how fast we do this. Oh, what the heck? This pillar blocked me. I feel betrayed by the game system. Nice. If I can just get out of the arrows, kind of, and kind of just like, hopefully not get shot by the arrows, we can activate some ghost dance. Come on. Quite a couple of archers over here. Did that archer just shoot his own teammate? Nice. Two more archers. Nice. Oh, we got it. We actually got a lot more people. That, that is a lot of people. And then kill the leader again. Always kill the leaders first. They're like the big heavies that you really do not want to be there. So why are you standing there? Defend yourself. Nice. One. Broken through. Right, where the rest of the Mongols? Oh, there's some more there. No running away. Why? Are you, why are you running away? Why are you? <laughs> I, I'll, I guess I'll let them live. I need to fight everyone else. Come on. 
The leader's gonna die today. That's a lot of people, not gonna lie. Okay, I guess we got some arrows, huh? I'm blinded. Oh, no. I kinda forgot about the fire. I'm not gonna die here while defending this temple. Okay, that's another flashbang. That's okay. Nice. Let's then take care of this guy. Oh, that guy's still alive. Nice. That was really intense battle. I mean, I still like Yarikawa better, but like, this this was a really fun mission as well. Just a lot of Mongols, like wave after wave, and also we got some arrows back, so that's pretty good. Now, where is Norio? Okay, is at the back of the temple. Run around a little bit, grab all the stuff, you know. Was is it a glitch, or is he supposed to be outside Hello. the temple walls? Mongols lost badly here. They won't be eager to return. The monks will never forget what you did for them. Okay, tell people our victory. We did this together. I didn't fight alone, Dorio. No, but if I had not listened to you, many more would be dead. What will you do now? It's time I return to see the temple. We still need your Naginata to drive the invaders from our home. You'll have it. And my temple will be a strong ally to you in the north. I'll join you there. Ah, yep, I was right. It is indeed. Check the temple grounds. It is indeed two acts split, two, nine missions split across two acts. Because he just said that he'll have an ally, which is when we fight at Castle Shimura, and uh, where is um, Norio? Uh, oh, there he is. But yeah, uh, that means the third region will be with um, him as well. So that'll be like the 8th and ninth mission, which is pretty cool. Let's go. Come on, Norio, where are we going? At least we got some arrows on it. I'm just really happy we got arrows. The Buddha. Oh no, the statue. My brother earned the name Guardian when he saved this temple. I wish we could have saved the statue. The statue's final lesson. Save what we can, but know that everything passes away. It's a worse statue when it's broken, but a better teacher. <laughs> right, but we finish off the seventh mission, the end of suffering, and I think that brings us to the end of what missions we can do for Norio in Act 2, which is, you know, I'm pretty happy about it. You know, pretty cool. That's kind of weird, we'll do like all nine or something in, in Act 2 and that'll be weird. But yeah, that should leave us with the end of the stuff in Act 2 and we'll continue Norio's story in Act 3. So yeah, we're going to end the video here for now. It has been a bit of a lengthy one, but honestly, if, I'm, if anything, I'm kind of surprised like the fourth mission, just it was just so short. But we did manage to do all of the ones that are available in Act two which is four five six and seven and as well as one two three obviously in the previous video but for now i'll leave you guys here and you guys staying safe and staying healthy and i'll see you guys in the next one so bye